So yesterday I was in Amsterdam for a commission in the beautiful part of town. Uh, it's that part behind uh, the Royal Concert Hall, Royal Concert Orchestra Hall, close to the Rijksmuseum. So it was great to walk there and um, I came by bike, I leave my fans somewhere else in town, a cheaper part, and then I take my bike and um, I've been drawing some sketches in the street of this house and uh, it was quiet and uh, lovely but cold it was actually too cold to work outside so I stayed in a in a pub in the afternoon to warm up with a hot coffee and today I came uh, by bike to the station here in The Hague that was beautiful too cold as well but uh, I don't mind there were people uh, skating on the on the lake on the ice that was beautiful and uh, yeah it was really sunny weather this morning and now it's totally cloudy again so I'm so happy that I went to Amsterdam because we have had rain and, and clouds for weeks for months so yesterday was a good week for sketching for commissions well, I will try to work this out this week for the client and um, I will start another commission of a house here close to my studio, a beautiful street with trees, bikes and um, the clients let me do it uh, in the way I would like to paint this subject so uh, I'm looking forward to start this one. Yeah, busy. For me, that's the key. Um, doing a lot at the same time, so you don't have time to think. Of course, there are thoughts all the time. They just come and go, even when you are at work. But um, for me, the key is uh, being busy. And this uh, active way of, of being all the time makes uh, the experience so strong. So you are doing, you are experiencing, and that's stronger than thinking, I guess. So when I have a lot to do, commissions, my own work, videos, maybe working on a book, meeting artists, interviews, projects, uh, then the concentration level is really high, really strong there is a, a good energy and painting together last week for the previous video with Anna Maria was really great painters are really solitary people of course we like to work on our own and that's that's nice but um, making a video like the previous one is really a good reason to to meet each other and um, the conversation is so naturally because I, I didn't write down any questions be before I met her I just start painting and uh, as I was painting the, the the questions came naturally for her as well so in my opinion this is really a nice um, strategy for for other videos I want to make a series um, maybe with 10 artists I, I made a list and I had a few phone calls already with some of them and they really like to join me so um, I will make more videos like the previous one. So two artists meeting each other, having a conversation while they are making their portraits. It's funny to see uh, 
uh, someone else painting your portrait because um, I'm making my, my self portraits as well sometimes and uh, I made countless of self portraits for the Academy. So I know my face and I know how to paint my face and then it's really interesting to, to see how somebody else makes this portrait. The only thing is that um, it's too much to, to do making such a video because I'm shooting a video with two cameras. One of the two is sh uh, shutting down every half an hour. And then I have two microphones, a preamp, so I'm checking the sound as well. I have my lights. Um, I'm making a portrait and I have a conversation. And that's too much at the same time. So fortunately I found someone who want to do this for me. I met him yesterday in Amsterdam and he has a lot of gear. So he will help me out uh, with the next video. He will join us and then uh, he's doing all everything. The sound, the light, the cameras and I only have to paint and to talk. So maybe we'll, we will do more together, we will see. And um, as soon as I have 10 videos, maybe I can put them online at the end of the year, weekly. Uh, or even put them sometimes between these videos uh, that I'm update that I'm streaming now. We will see. But the idea is really great, and I'm thankful for your comments under this video. Uh, it's nice to read what you see, and uh, yeah, it's good to meet, good to connect, and to see what what we do with painting.
time for weekends. I was not able to finish this one this week. I will do it next week. Uh, I was too much on the road. Thank you for joining me again this week. Uh, as you know, I love to read your comments. I'm not able to, fin to answer them all. But I read them all. I really enjoy it. And uh, Enjoy your weekend. Enjoy winter. And uh, I'll see you next week.